Hello everyone, this is Al Kabir, the analyst, and today I'll be talking the NFL officially added another game. Also, fans will be allowed into the stadium. Not a good idea to add another game, but this is Al Kabir, the analyst. All right, um, I seen this yesterday, meant to talk about it yesterday, but as my old subscribers know, got a family so gotta adjust a bit so i'm just trying to do all these things in a 24-hour span all right um so yeah the nfl officially added a game right not a good idea no reason why is because it's simple too many injuries too many injuries I mean, it, it does give your team a better shot of making the playoffs, but you add a playoff game, you add a regular season game, it's just not good. And I understand they want to get that money back up. And people are going to be excited to watch games again. That's why they're going to have people in the stands again. It, it, it makes sense. It makes sense as far as a money standpoint, but you cut these guys' money, but you want them to play extra all these restructures and things like that that's just another word of yeah we we'll pay you later or we'll give you this bonus and your contract further back will be less that's it and that's all that's that's what the restructuring and all this stuff is is either we give you a sign a bonus up front get paid less later on or you get paid more later on but right now you're getting paid less that's all this restructuring is doing and Al Kamara came out like basically saying this bullshit, man. I don't like to curse my videos, but that's what he's basically saying. Because it's like, once again, you've seen the injuries. Think of the players that got injured last season. That Prescott, Saquon Barkley, um, Bosa from the San Francisco 49ers, um, Brandon Brooks. And this is just not having a regular offseason. But now you decide to add extra games, you think think these players will be able to stay healthy all that time? I, I don't think so. A lot of key players are going to get hurt. It just happens. It's not meant for the human body to contact like that all the time. Think of the dangerous sports you watch besides football, UFC, boxing. They fights and stuff is uh, spanned it out you might not see Floyd Mayweather fight for a year or six months or something like that because your body got to get retrained and get ready for that type of contact so NFL is basically the same way but you having it week after week after week then you got the Thursday games then you got the Monday games like sometimes those games could be back to back and it's like I don't know if these guys can take that. You have to really think of it. Now, I did read a statistic once again. From 2019 to 2020, the first half of the season, injuries went up 16%. That's a lot. That is a lot. And you're risking that again. You're chasing the money. I get it. And the NFL has to recoup. But at what cost? At what cost? Are you willing to lose a, a couple franchise quarterbacks who can't make it through all those games? Are you willing to lose some running backs that can't make it or wide receivers or any type of marquee skill position? Are you willing to lose that? So sometimes chasing the money is not always a good thing. I get it. Add, the, add another playoff team, add another playoff game or whatever you want to do kudos i i personally like it but to add another regular season game potentially give a team a chance to tank nah but maybe you could give a, a team a chance to make the playoffs but i believe six playing 16 games is good enough but i think they're using fans hunger to watch football and once again i believe they're just trying to recoup so they just literally thinking about money that like these players health is at well it's on the line these players health is on the line 
Uh, are you willing to lose? I, I don't want to jinx none of these guys, but are you willing to lose like a Russell Wilson possibly getting hurt or even a Tom Brady possibly getting hurt because he's getting up in age? You see Patrick Mahomes been dealing with these net net injuries. Are you willing to get those type of marquee players hurt just to get an extra game and possibly extra money to make up? At the end of the day, if that ends up happening, you probably hustling backwards because people will stop watching less because the superstars drawn or draw fans to watch. And I'm talking about the casual fans. Maybe somebody don't like a team, but like Patrick Mahomes or like Tom Brady. So you, you're you risking that adding another game. You're simply risking that. To me, for no apparent reason. For no apparent reason. NFL is going to make their money. But Roger Cadell, man, uh, not a good idea. It's not a good idea. But what do you think and how do you feel about the NFL adding another game, man? It's not good. Once again, it's not good and it's not good. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Ghost.